Doop. Let me do a review of this Argus. Now, I will say this. The Argus, if you don't know about the Argus, it's a mongoose 26-inch beast. It's it's uh, black and or purple. It's, I think it's, it's purple, but it, it, you really can't tell. Purple. Maybe it's black with purple accents. I don't know. But I think they dropped the ball. Instead of red tires or orange, they should have made them purple like that. It would have been beast. Anyway, this bike's unbelievable. It's a 10-speed mountain bike. I put this on brightest light you'll ever find in your life. It's the greatest light. Look at five LEDs. That thing's bright as a motherfucker. Anyway, it's a 10-speed. Tires are 4.9 inches. I thought they were 4.8, but they say 4.9. Um, I don't know nothing about bikes, but I did buy this long john. This is nice. I put shit in there that I need. Got my water now. Hey, listen. I should have uh, just bought the... Uh, I got to get a thing for this. Cause this is heavy. It fits perfect, but it's heavy. I'm trying to loosen the weight up. But uh, as far as the bike goes... Oh, by the way, it's a large frame. I could have probably got a medium, to be honest with you. Uh, I love it. I, I rode this last night at 3 o'clock in the morning. I love this bike. Um, I put the kickstand on it. Someone says, oh, you shouldn't put a kickstand on this bike. What am I doing? Lay it on the fucking ground? Yeah, I got a kickstand. And the kickstand did have another part that was supposed to reach up the hair. Let me show you. It has another part that's supposed to reach up the hair, but this bike's too big for it. No matter where you it don't work. So I don't need it. I just tighten this down. It's not going nowhere. Um... I love this bike. It's fucking biblical. Uh, the seat, I put a new seat on it. I'll be honest with you, I don't even like this seat either. I, it's just not comfortable. You would think it'd be comfortable. Right here is the worst fucking part. Now, I know they make a seat, a noseless seat. I might try that. I'm not sure yet. Um, I did have a seat that I took back. I should have kept it. It was another Schwinn seat. It was similar to this, but it didn't have these... Uh, it was flatter, and it was way more comfortable. I should have kept the motherfucker, but I, I wanted, you know, I'm trying seats out to see which one I like. I think I'm just going to get Cloud 9. Uh, I ride this, and I can tell I'm losing fat. I can just feel it. I can just feel a lot better. When I rode a bike, these are disc brakes. They had the fucking brakes up here on the fucking rim. The little rubber or whatever. Uh, when I put this together, I did have the fork backwards. I had this part over here, but I actually liked it better that way. I wonder if there's a way you could raise this up at all. Probably. I don't know if I should or not. Rides great. Um, I love it. I'm thinking about actually putting a motor on her, electric motor on her, for when I don't want to uh, pedal. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, it's got internal routing. You see, the the uh, that's nice. The wires are hidden inside, so they don't fuck with you. Inter internal internal routing. I bet I bet that'd be a bitch to work on her. I don't know if you had to get them off. Who knows? Uh, they got ways to fix that. They put a string on it. And go, I don't fucking know. I don't give a fuck either. Anyway, uh, that light's great. The seat, mm, not so great. It's better than the seat that came on it, though. The seat that came on it was a bitch. Um, I'm, like I say, I'm new to... Oh, someone said I should get pedals, too. And I did some research. They say wider pedals because you you exert more uh, force on... It's just better. And I was also thinking, too... I don't know nothing about mountain bikes. I don't know anything about bikes. I wonder if I could get a bigger one of these. What are these, sprockets? Wouldn't it make it easier to pedal if it was bigger? You would think, right? But I don't know. I wonder if any. I wonder if it's possible. I don't know. I'm not going to do it. I'm just saying, if it's possible, if it would make it easier to pedal, I might be inclined to do it. I don't fucking know. But the Argus, I got this on Amazon, and it's a beast bike. I love it. It really is. Uh, I just, I think it's great to ride. It's fun to ride this bike. But I'd like to put an electric motor on it so I can take it and just uh, cruise something. But you know that defeats the purpose. I'm trying to get in shape. That's the main thing. I'm. I'm that's what I want. I want to lose fat. I hate running, and this is good exercise. Plus. If I want to go fishing, I can put my fishing stuff right here, put the pole right here, and I'm good. I can take it anywhere I want. Fishing, you know, maybe I'll go fishing tomorrow because I don't golf no more. For some reason, once football started, I had no desire to golf. Maybe I will go fishing tomorrow because I can always, like I say, put the pole coming up here. Boom. So I love this thing, though. What is this? Oh, it's just grip. I was going to say, I thought there were more buttons. Oh, if you want to see the light, look. Look how bright that fucker is. That's, that's the brightest. There's lower. I drive it on that mainly because that's perfect. And then it's got the blinking light, the uh, whatever. And there you go. It lasts for like 15 hours. It's unbelievable. So the Argus Mongoose, I guess it's like a Dolomite, but better. It's a big bike. Like I say, it's a large frame. I really do like it. I am going to get new pedals because uh, they say it will make it easier. Because you, I don't know, I don't, I don't know how to explain it, but I don't give a fuck to explain it. But I do like the disc brakes. The brakes work great. Oh, here's another thing I like. See that? You don't need a wrench. Pull that down, 
it's just easy to work on because you, can, you tighten that. It's just easy to work on that way. I don't know if you're supposed to check them all the time. Get in the front tire. This bike comes pre-assembled. Everything's on except you got to put the seat, the handlebars on, and the front tire and the pedals. And I had a hell of a time getting this thing uh, on this front tire to line up. I wonder if I should check this to make sure it's tight all the time. I don't know if you got to keep checking these or not, but it's not loose or nothing. So, and will I wash the bike? No, I don't care what it looks like. To be honest with you, I don't even care if it gets scratched up. I don't want it to, but if it does, it does. I don't care. You know, I'm not one of them guys. What are these for? They got more routing spots. What are, what are those for? Is that, is that just in case you want to route them on that side? I don't know. Obviously, it's routing spots, but I don't know. Who knows? But the chain, I got to oil it. I did put oil on it a couple days ago, but maybe I'll oil it again. Anyway, I am definitely getting another seat. That seat ain't comfortable. Actually, the other Schwinn seat I had, was it was flat. Way more comfortable than this. Way more. I fucked up. I should have kept it. I do love this thing, though. It's got a whole bunch of compartments. All I got in there is a little Allen wrench and a uh, wrench. Just in case I... Oh, that's that fucking thing. I sat on it. Uh, what else? Oh, people are talking about this thing being loose when you hit bumps. This thing is perfect. You just got to take a crescent wrench and tighten it. If you hand tighten it, it's not going to get tight enough. I took a crescent wrench, tightened it. It's beautiful. So there's the Argus. 4.9 inch tires. It's it's just a great bike. It's a great bike. I mean, like I said, I, I'm not a bike rider. I don't know nothing about it. But I am gonna not gonna lie to you. I love riding this motherfucker. Cause every time I ride it, I know I'm getting in better shape, and it's fun to ride. I think it'd be even funner if I had a fucking electric motor on it where I could if I get tired. Like like last night, I took like a, maybe a seven mile ride, and I was fucking dead on the way home. Not gonna lie. But I didn't have to walk it. I refused to. But another thing I do uh. I like I like to look at the welds are beautiful on here. They really do a good job welding. I've seen some bikes where the welds were fucking terrible. They do a nice job. So, there's the Argus. The reason the bike's inside is because uh, I was going to make this video. It's brighter in here. I should have made it out in the yard. That's what I should have done. Made it out in the street, but I don't like my neighbors, so I fucking hate them all. Whatever. People wonder why I got this bike. I'm trying to get myself into better shape. That's why I bought it, and I... I do like the fact that when the winter time comes, I'm going to be riding this in the snow. That's the main reason I bought it. I get bored. I like to drive around in the snow. Well, now I'll drive around in the snow with this. Oh, by the way, these front tires are so fucking light. When I picked the front tire, I expected it to weigh a lot more than it did. It feels like it's got styrofoam in it. I don't know if these are tubeless or not. I have no clue. And I don't even know what the pressure is on these tires because whatever it came with is whatever I'm using. So let me see. It feels like it's got pretty much pressure in it. I wish it didn't have a lot of pressure. That means I could put more pressure in it and it'd be easier to ride. But I'm assuming it's got almost max pressure in whatever it came with. So I'm 252 pounds right now. Well, no, 246 actually. But so this thing fits me perfect. I am definitely getting new uh, pedals though. So there's the Argus. I could have got, like I say, I really wanted to buy the Malice. And I, the color I wanted wasn't going to be in for one to three months. And then I wanted to get the black one, and it was sold out. I should have bought the black one right away. It was sold out the next day. And then I seen this. I'm actually glad I got this one because it's. I think it's bigger than the Malice. And everyone I've seen said they were glad they didn't get the... You know, I'm just glad I got this one over the Malice. This is more money, but I like it, so... I love it. I do. I just wish that purple was a little more... Because uh, even in person, it's hard to see, really. Actually, it looks great that way. It's got to be purple. But it's, I call this bike the Lamar or the Raven. I'm going to call it the Raven. It is the Raven. Or no, I'll call it the Lamar. See the L there? It is Lamar because it's a Baltimore Raven. Even though I hate Lamar Jackson and the Ravens, it's Lamar. So there's my fucking video. Just accept it and deal with it. And I will say this. I don't know if these are supposed to be... I guess they are, but... I'm trying to think. My hand's on here. I don't know. I don't know nothing about it, so I'm not taking those off. I'm not, I'm not even fucking with nothing here. I don't know nothing about nothing. I don't know how to fucking work on a bike. Like I said, I had these fucking handlebars on backwards. Someone said it in the comment section. I thought they were trolling me, but they were right. I should have known better. But, um, whatever. So, there it is. This thing is nice to have. It is. I've seen some people have these on hanging underneath. But seeing that the zipper's up here, I put it on the top. I, sur I surmise it could go either way, but I like it better on top. I never tried it underneath. I just think it looks better on top. I don't know. I don't give a fuck. <laughs>